I am currently the executive director of uh, Gawad Kalinga. We're gunning to end poverty for 5 million families by 2024. This year, we were able to mobilize 100,000 volunteers all across 33 uh, provinces in this country. I feel I'm just the face of, of the thousands of volunteers doing the job. There was this one moment in Magsungay, and there was this one kid who tells me, good for you because uh, you can eat three times, but for us here, we could barely eat once. I realized from that moment that uh, poverty is not the inaction of God, but of man's. How can we continue to aspire for bigger and better things for ourselves, you know, when five million are, are, are left homeless, landless, and, and hungry? So see, the work of GK is really connecting to the goodness of, of everyone. When the Filipino youth will not, will not think of themselves, but really think of the common good, I see that 10, 15 years from now, this will be a very different country. I'm Anna Oposa and I'm the co-founder of Save Philippine Seas. Save Philippine Seas started in 2011 because of this major issue that hit the news called the Rape of the Philippine Seas. It was a large-scale extraction of, of, of our marine resources in southern Philippines. In the last two years, we've done a lot of online campaigns and workshops, talks. The biggest one that I've been working on is called the Shark Shelter Project, which is a community-based, multi-stakeholder project in Cebu. When I was 18, I had to go on a coastal cleanup. I remember going underwater and seeing like diapers and sanitary napkins and I thought we need to be doing something more. Like we can't just pretend that there's nothing happening. I think it makes sense to do something for the seas. I mean, we're a country of 7,107 islands. For me, doing more is the relentless pursuit of a cause greater than yourself. I know how it is to be a woman in communities. I've seen a lot of women who are abused. Sometimes they are so heartbreaking that uh, I started focusing on women's issues. I had uh, the women's organization, Democratic Socialist Women of the Philippines. We work for women's uh, empowerment. It's a difficult job. We started with women, for instance, who wouldn't even stand up and say their names. So when we started legislative advocacy, we found out that uh, Many of our laws are actually against women. We are amongst uh, those who led the uh, passage of uh, the anti-rape law, the anti-violence against women and their children, and the reproductive health law. What we're trying to do is help make available the things that they need. Doing more, it is looking for creative solutions to existing problems that will benefit others. I am Beth Angkyoko, and I do more. I'm Anna Pasa, and I do more. I'm Luis Okenyana, I do more. Hooah!